Here we have uh, Illustrator, the icon in the dock. You can drag that from your hard drive, make it easier to open up. If I go to File, go New, we can choose uh, the size of our working area. A uh, letter is quite common, I would suggest, 800 by 600. Or you can have a custom size if you prefer. I'm going to select letter. Here in units, we can decide if we want it in uh, pixels or picas used for uh, designing uh, magazines and stuff. They often use the term picas. But we're going to stick to inches. Orientation, I would go for vertical rather than horizontal here. We're going to leave it on RGB color. And we can change the name here. My try, let's say, and go OK. Uh, this is uh, your working area over here on the sides, and behind these pallets are your scratch areas. So you can move items over to here, and until you need them, then move them back into your working area. Your tool pallet over here, and we have additional pallets also over here. You can also, with the nice thing about uh, Illustrator, is you can move the uh, tabs here and create your own personalized. So if you wanted layers to be up here, there we go, it's joined with appearance and you can have those two tabs combined there. And again, if you decide that you, you're you using something like, let's say, appearances all the time, and I'm just going to put swatches down here so you can see the difference here. Oops, hold on. Move swatches down here. And let's say that uh, this is your window right now, but you're always using appearance. You don't have to click clicking on the tab, simply drag it out and you can have it independent from the rest.